Hi folks, this is Steve Grono, and I am the owner over at a little company in Howell, Michigan, Chestnut Development. You can Google me and I've got a little real estate office. I do small projects, apartments, and single family homes. Um, we just finished a big project. We're selling a bunch of our equipment, and I'm gonna tell you about this one uh, inside and out and give you some history. I bought this machine brand new. It's a 2016 Bobcat T870. This is the biggest one that they make with the heaviest lifting capacity. Uh, I think it's a 100 horse diesel in there. Um, has all the uh, hookups for many, many attachments. Uh, we have maintained it since new, oil changes, lubes, tracks, adjustments, cleaning, all that kind of stuff uh, in-house with our own people. Uh, Bobcat of Lansing sold it to us new. They have the records also. And uh, anyway, let me tell you about it. Okay, so uh, it comes with this bucket, has a bolt-on cutting edge. Uh, it's a hydraulic quick change up front, obviously. Uh, tracks were replaced very recently. Um, I'm thinking within a hundred-ish hours ago we put tracks on this machine. The drive sprockets, as you can see, have full meat on the teeth. Um, the idler wheels are all rolling. Uh, the bearings are all good. There isn't any issues with anything on the undercarriage at all. Cab is nice. This machine's not been rolled over or knocked around or anything like that. It's been kept in really nice shape. Here's the build tag and the serial number right there. ASW T11834 T870 2016 model year. Um, <clears throat> this has just been through the shop, so we did a full maintenance uh, and to make it job ready. It's, it's actually ready. For, there's nothing to do but run it to the job site and put it to work right now. Uh, engine bay is right here. I'm going to show you that. This is the, I believe this is a 100 horse diesel. Um, we've just, just done a service on it. That's the factory Bobcat oil filter that we use. Um, no issues here in the powertrain at all. We just put a new torque belt on it. Um, it's one of the wear items on these. And radiators up here are good. Air conditioning works fine. Everything mechanically on it is up to par and ready to go. Um, back of the machine, as you can see, it's not all banged up. Upper portions are not banged up. It's not been hit anything. This is the right or left hand side of the machine right here. Uh, tracks are, as I said, they're nice. There's a couple small superficial cuts in the tracks, but they don't affect um, anything about the way it runs. It runs fine. Uh, this is this drive sprocket on the left side. As you can see, that's in good shape. All these rollers and idlers are working and moving properly. Uh, yeah, so that's okay. Over on the left side here is your Hook up for all the Bobcat attachments, quick change couplers there. Um, we have a bunch of attachments. If you're interested in anything, uh, give me a call and I'll tell you about what we've got. We've got about every attachment known to man for Bobcat. And uh, this is the front windshield. It's clean. There's no wiper marks or cracks or anything in the windshield. Um, the seat inside is nice. There's no splits in the seat or anything. $37.99 is the hours. Original hours, thirty-seven ninety-nine. We've we've changed hydraulic oil filters, uh, engine oil filters, cab filters. Every filter in this machine has been changed, and we stocked the parts for it right here in our shop. This one has uh, AM, FM radio, uh, air conditioning, heat, many different settings for attachments. Uh, owner's manuals right there in the back as well. So I'm going to start it up, and uh, Ben over here is going to run it for you, right, Ben? <laughs> okay, so so just so you can get a sense of how it runs um, before it leaves here, it's uh, it's got really nothing. I've got no bad stories to tell about this machine. It's been a great machine for me. I'm just done with my projects for a little while, and there's no sense keeping it for a year without using it. So it's got a coded entry. So there's a passcode you plug in to start it, and uh, and then you then you then you, you know you have some security as to who's using the machine. Also, you can put passcodes on it for each person and keep track of their hours of operation on the machine. You can put a job in there, and um, you can keep track of how many hours you have on a particular job. So here's just a little bit of it working and running in the shop here. Now, it's an amazing machine. This, this machine will lift... This will lift a, another skid steer of this class right up off the ground. It's got a lot of power in this front carriage. Um, we've, we've, never, we've never tried to lift anything with it that we couldn't lift. This is a quick change Ben is demonstrating right now for the bucket. It just powers up and down right there. So you can change attachments quickly. And just showing there's no weird noises. 
this transmission is silent. Um, no smoke, no nothing. It runs just like the day we bought it. We've had no problems. That's a backup alarm. And this gives you just some sense about it. I want you to be 100% comfortable with our equipment. Um, I make it absolutely right before I let it go. So if any questions on this machine, you can feel free to give me a call cell phone. Again, my name is Steve Grono and uh, my cell phone, thank you Ben, my cell phone number is 810-599-5147. Machine's located in Howell, Michigan and the zip code if you want to check mileage uh, for shipping is 48843. Um, we have guys here that can help you load it if you're going to ship it out of state. Um, if you want to see more any details, just call me and I'll do a FaceTime video with you or anything that you like to make you comfortable. It's, it's definitely, definitely a great machine. I can sell it to you with you know, full confidence. You won't have any complaints. Uh, thanks again, Steve Grono, 810-599-5147. I hope that was helpful. Thank you.